What is up guys? This is the first time I've ever done a run with the big Sony uh, camera setup here facing myself. So this is gonna be an added arm workout. This whole setup, oh boy. Sorry, the joystick uh, it's, it's a little out of hand, you know. Played a lot of video games growing up, but still, sometimes if you're not steady with the trigger, things can go a little crazy. But um, yeah, this camera setup is, oh, already right on, it's already getting tired. It's like six pounds, eight pounds, something in that range. Um, so it's all in the, like all in the forearms when we're running here. So it's a different challenge today. Um, kind of a good early test for me in the year to you know, make sure my arms are, are ready to go for all the filming, running content that will be happening this year. Um, yeah, the hardest challenges I've had so far with it was the last three miles of Canal Corridor with JD3 and then chasing Sarah Beale uh, for part of Promise Land with this thing. You know, on a downhill section was ridiculous. So we're just gonna go out here, continue to enjoy this day. And uh, yeah, it'll be a good little vlog. So new little setup, testing it out. It'll be a kind of good episode to kind of just catch up on life too, which I'm excited for. So let's keep it moving here. I actually looked and saw that I wasn't gonna get hit by a car this week, which is an improvement from last week. I didn't look to see if I was gonna get hit by a car. So we're making big, big moves. That dinosaur was just doing his own thing last week. But yeah, it's, uh, it's got some updates for me, I guess. We can dive into those. We're about three weeks out. Oh boy. I'm really struggling today. I did not eat lunch, so uh, your boy is huffing and puffing. We need to slow it down. Okay, but regardless, three weeks out from Gorge Waterfall, 100K. It's gonna be awesome. I'm pumped to get out there. Pacific Northwest vibes. Uh, back in Oregon for a trail race, first time for me since 2018. And I'm excited for it. It'll be kind of one of the first races that I've done since Shawnee 2018, where I'm kind of going into it with just a let's have fun mindset. Like there's just no, no goals. Like I haven't looked at any results. I, I don't know what a good time is. I couldn't tell you what the cutoff is. Like I literally know very little about um, those other things that kind of come with races when you're trying to, you know, maybe go for a certain time or, or go for a PR, you know, when can you make a move on a course? And for me, it's not about that, which I'm pumped for. So um, I'm just gonna go out there and have fun, which is gonna be awesome. So I'm gonna show you guys out of downtown Missoula now. Gonna give some of my arms a break. And uh, yeah, just moving nicely here. Man, it's so nice when you can actually hear the river and not Cam laughing in the background the whole time. My goodness. I've done the same loop each week so far. Probably keep it that way. Or maybe we won't. We'll see. We'll see what the challenges bear. I think there's some, uh, you know, vert challenges and some other fun ones that people are gonna have me start doing here, all within a one mile span. So I'm excited to see what those are like when those finally make their way to me. But all right, I'll bring it back around. We'll see what we can do. Oh. This thing is just ridiculous with one arm. But yeah, it's gonna be a good good week for me. I think this is ideally feeling good. I might try to hit like 70 miles or so. Um, kind of like my threshold. It's for, you know, when I'm actually training when I feel good. So um, that's gonna be my first big week in 
Maybe this hole. We're back this way. Okay. And we're back this way. This thing is just ridiculous to hold with one hand and run while facing yourself. I don't know if this has ever been done, but regardless, yeah, big week this week for me. Gotta hit a midweek long run. Gotta hit a good long run on the weekend. So I'm pumped for both of those. Uh, it is gonna be a little colder this week up in Missoula. We had a nice little warm patch last week up in the high 40s or low 50s. We're back down in the teens uh, this week for a couple days before we wrap up uh, the winter down here. And uh, it actually starts to warm up next week, hopefully for the rest of eternity. So it's gonna be good. I'm, I'm pretty used to the cold at this point. Um, I honestly would probably struggle to run in like 50, 60 degree weather consistently right now. I'm a heat runner by naturally. Like I love running in the heat, but this is just different, uh, different times out here. So we're moving well. I'm actually gonna add on today after the Monday mile. Um, it's kind of get a good start for the week. I'll probably do six more uh, without the camera. But yeah, this is a good one. Um, I'm sure you'll see at some point, possibly, Cam is in the Pacific Northwest. That's why he's not joined right now on this Monday mile. But he's gonna have some awesome footage, I think, for you guys. And uh, kind of do some cool, fun, fun little things himself too. So hopefully can showcase his fun little adventure that he's on right now uh, in the near future. Cause I'm, I'm personally excited to see that. So we'll see how that goes and we'll just keep it moving here. Oh boy. I think cars are looking at me stranger now than they did last week, honestly. I think people are like, oh, this guy's holding a camera, massive camera facing himself. And then last week I was just a dinosaur, I was just a guy. You know, no one was really looking at me. Pretty inconspicuous, I would say, but yeah, big, big changes this week for sure. Big changes. Oh, okay. Let's take a walking break. While I wait for this car to go. Okay. Feeling pretty good though. I thought it was gonna be pretty, pretty bonked on this run naturally, but I feel pretty pumped up about the first mile with the camera. And then I'll do six more kind of on trails, hit up waterworks. It's about like a 600 foot climb, I think. Um, nothing too, too crazy, but uh, uh, compared to out here. So uh, I'm pumped to get up there, enjoy some trail magic in the evening. We're officially one week away from uh, my favorite holiday. And I'm pumped this Saturday night, daylight savings time, where finally Monday miles will be in the light for the rest of eternity until the November when uh, they might be in the dark again. But this thing good. Okay, we're almost done here. This is kind of a rambly episode, but we'll just kind of mix them up, add in some different type of content. This one is more, like I said, for, for me to get the arms going. And uh, I think we accomplished that in this mile, so. Okay, 0 0.98. 0.99, on 9.15 mile with the camera. I will take that. I will take that all day. So, thanks for watching another Monday mile with Wesley. We'll see you guys next week for hopefully another challenge. We'll see you guys soon.